Yes. 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 Do you guys want to do uh, the first spin episode, maybe? Maybe the first spin episode of Christmas could be fun. So if you've never seen one of these, here's the deal, right? The every spin challenge. Can we profit playing every spin on Party Poker, excluding the 25 cent and the one for a ticket? Um, so we're going to play each of these seven levels and see if by the end we have more caches than buy-ins. Starting off at the $1 level, let's get it going. We're started up in the first spin. One buck. But hey, every cash counts. We are playing it for $3 here, a little 3x, all right? Let's see how we get it on. This is a spin ultra, so it's faster than the normal spins. And we're gonna raise king eight, first hand. Al Stuti, drop the 39 month resub, greets the clubs. Oh, the clubs, what's up, man? What's up? We're gonna bet here with her king eight. Very likely we have the best hand. A lot of ace X hands from our opponent is gonna go all in preflop, right? So. It's kind of hard for them to have an ace, and other than that, we have the best hand, you know. So, pretty good spot. 6-4, let's check back. Very good flop. We flop a pair of fours. I am going to bet this time. But it doesn't come out till a day or two from now, but I think it's supposed to be a pretty big deal. We'll see. So, the only way we win this pot is if we bluff. So, let's just pretend we have a full house. Because I don't think they do have a full house based on how small they're betting. I think they probably have like a high card. So we're gonna turn our pair of fours into a bluff. Try and get them to fold the, the high card ace or king. And I think it worked out, there you go. A successful bluff. In the $1 level, don't say you can't bluff at the small stakes, you can. It just has to be a good spot, right? It has to be a spot where it's hard for them to call because it's so easy to have absolutely nothing. All right, 15.30, we're gonna go all in with the king 10 here. 10 blinds and five blinds. Good enough hand. Good enough hand to run it, so we do. We take it down 475. We've got just over half the chips in play. Deuce four suited is a bad hand. Definitely folding to this all in for 10 blinds and fold the deuce eight as well. Nothing we can do with this trash. Uh, I think all in again, it's 2040 now, so especially here, we are looking at 7.7 .7 blinds and four blinds. Queen nine suited is enough against ace 10. This is pretty much for all the marbles here. If we win this, we're very likely to win. And we do with the straight, let's go. 10 looks bad, but it's not, it's not bad. Okay, interesting. So it's 80 to win 160, two to one, but I think with seven three, it's a fold. I think we fold like very few hands, but a couple, and I think seven three is one of them. Queen 10 against threes, we're flipping it up. Oh, spade? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Don't let them back into this match as we get the walk with the Robbie. And we give the walk with the deuce nine. We fold to the jam here. It's a limp, we check. Gotta check, man, gotta check. It's a total miss. So we're basically tied. Now, uh, we get a walk, which is nice because we are gonna have to fold again to the all-in there. Seven, five. Uh, I think we're all in here. I don't know for sure on like 6.2 blinds. Um, I think being suited is gonna tick us over into the we go for it, but it seems kind of close. We take it down. We suck out against the East four, but barely. You know, like barely suck out. And we win three bucks, just like that. The first one is a $3 cash. $1 in buy-in, $3 in cashes. Nice start, but we're gonna ramp it right up to the $3 buy-in now. So let's get in there, play an ultra. Uh, all right, we got a $3 spin here. Doug Bogey dropped the 44 months resub. Welcome back, Doug Bogey. How are you, man? Thank you. Welcome back to the team as we are playing for six bucks here. We got a 2x. Not our favorite. Six dollars is the potential prize. And race, 910. Got a fold to the three bet. Huge. Where's the hype chat? Listen, first win is good. I'm pretty sure one of the recent episodes, we won the first six. 
straight, which was pretty sick. I'm gonna pull the 10-5. We are all in with the queen eight suited, eight blinds deep-ish, and we take down the blinds, which is okay. King five suited, we will call it all in if they shove, and if they limp, I think it's close between check back and shove if they limp. I'll probably check back. But here we go with the ace jack of spades. Beautiful stuff. Love the ace jack of spades, and I think we're gonna limp to induce here, actually. It's just such a strong hand. I think we wanna limp to induce. 10 6 deuce, two spades. Let's go for a little bet. Quick call, deuce in the turn. Check. Check. We probably have the best hand. We're worried about a six primarily, but like, we probably have the best hand here. Damn. How does fours not go all in pre flop, man? We should be out of this thing, but we're alive. Uh, we're gonna pull the queen four. Definitely, like, if someone limps into me, I have a pair of fours. I'm going to go all in in that spot for sure. Had a great weekend shooting craps in Harris Metropolis. Too bad they removed the poker room there during COVID. Ugh, oh, sad vibes. But this is going to be a fold. We can come back. It's going to have to be with 3-8. We are priced in even with this garbage hand. Um, but we can do this. 36%. That's not too bad. A little bit less now. GG. Unfortunately, that is a zero. So our buy-ins are now $4, $3 in cashes. Moving on to the $5 level. We can win up to a milli here. That would be fun. Here we go. Playing for 10 bucks, we got a 2x. Not ideal, but that's okay. Beautiful, love this hand. We got a limp on the button from Yonath N. I don't know, probably gamble here. Good luck. Ace five, king jack, king queen. Ace five in such a good spot when we uh, both have king jack, but boom! Queen on the river. Taking it down for 10 bucks, that's the easiest 10 bucks of my life, I think. $10, cash is $13, buy-ins $9. All right, sweet. What a tail. <clears throat> $10 buy-in, let's go. Are we just all in with the pair of twos here? That's my first impression. Does it make money? I don't know. Let's go for it. I don't know if it makes money. No antis, 15 blinds, dry on the button. Not sure. Uh, I've never really checked out much of the Northeast at all. Just one casino in Atlantic City. Uh, I'm going to try and limp here. I think that's fine. Twos rarely lose. That's what they say. How about the queens? Do queens rarely lose? I sure hope so, because we are playing a big pot here. To take a big lead, we got to dodge the king and the queen. Let's go. Beautiful stuff, man. Beautiful stuff. What a great start. Playing for $20 here, and we've got a commanding lead. 10-6 is a bad hand, so if the button kind of plays this spot aggressively, then I think we want to get out of the way. I still feel like I want to get out of the way. They raise the doors open. Fun side fact, in the sixth grade, I won an award for the best creative writing in some contest for all of California. Bro, it's time to fire up the novel. It's time. Another one of them, I will promote the novel. It's time to fire it up. Rollin, King Deuce, against Ace-4, against King-6. We need a Queen. We need a 9. We need nothing. We lose the pot. I think I'm going to lead here. If I check, they're going to bet, and I don't really like check-raising. Uh, now we have a double gutter, so now I'm going to check-raise. Let's check-check really fast. 
Was that check check like check call anything or was that? Yeah, I think I'm gonna call it here, especially when I make the five. Because with a king, right? If you have a top pair of kings, you're at least gonna somewhat think about whether you want to raise my bet, you know? So it kind of has to be an eight. That just is like call anything, you know? Well, only with a pretty garbage hand, but like we have three blinds, so we need something to happen. How about a jack? How about a five? How about a deuce? <sighs> Zero bucks. Zero dollars. We had a really good lead there, but no dice. Nineteen dollars. We're buying now. Thirteen in cashes, but we're getting to the big money now. Twenty dollar ultra. Let's go. Playing for forty dollars. Raise call against one opponent and against two opponents fold. Call it all in if it comes in. Good luck. Yes. 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 Let's go. Good stuff, man. All right. That's a huge first hand. Two to one chip advantage. Do it. How boring, man. You know, we just trap them with the tens. 13 blinds deep. They don't fall for the bait, and we see a terrible flop. Check, check here. We can bet river if it checks to us. Try to get a call from a weak nine, from a four, from a king high, primarily. Their ability to have an ace or a jack is quite low here, I'd say. Take it down. We will call it all in here with king 10. Our opponent is... 8.7 blinds deep, heads up here, but they limp. You can jam or check king 10. Problem with king 10 is we don't fold up better hands. We're, we're just folding out hands that, you know, have 35% or 40% equity against us. And so is it worth it when they limp call with ace five? You know, like, I don't know. Probably the best hand here. I think we should let them bluff though. It's the, probably the best way to make money in this spot. They have a full house. Wow. I uh, We could have lost more money there. I'll tell you that. We could have lost more. Okay. About tied here. I think we will fold queen three. I never know if it's like the junky queens or the junky jacks in these heads ups where I'm uh, folding some of them. Uh, at 30-60, I think we want to jam ace-jack offsuit. If we're suited, I'm going to limp again here to try and do some action. Keep some strong hands in my limping range, but the offsuit, I think it's better to just go for the shove. 500-400. Let's go. Big pick up. Here we go. This could be it for 40 bucks. Do it! Okay, rolling. Come on, man. Ace 10 into aces. Nine blinds deep, really? Ah, oh, brutal. That's a brutal one. What can you do, though? I mean, honestly, what can you do about that? Nothing at all. You just take the punishment and you move on. Uh, we still have a chance here as well. I mean, we're going to play for 170 chips. We do one more double up. You know, that's possible. We need a deuce. We are now dead. GG in that one. I mean, listen, you're going to get cooler sometimes. It is how it is. $0, 39 in buy-ins. Tough. Two more chances. 13 in cash is 39 in buy-ins. We've got two more chances. We need one more player to register in the 50 here. Here we go. $50 ultra. Oh my goodness, playing for 250. Let's go. I was distracted on the side. Come on, man. We're going to fold the queen seven. So this would definitely give us a profit no matter what. This is the challenge right here. Can we win this spin ultra? And honestly, I think it's our time. After losing that ace 10 of aces, and we're behind, but like, come on. It's our time. Let's do this. If they fold, we limp. 
there is we fold uh, I think a little bit here I think of the a side boards we get to bet some um, even though we check a lot out of position there here we go fours threes call double it up not today but not bad King 10, pretty good. If they jam, we call. This is big. Having a little fun tonight. Say bon. Say uh, très bien. Bienvenue, Shaheen. Bienvenue. I was thinking about limping, but I think jam is fine. Come on, dude. Someone. No! The walk. The walk with the jacks? Come on. Oh, brutal. Jacks a6. To take a big lead, dodge the ace, dodge the four. That's fine because we hit set on the turn. Let's go. Two to one chip lead. $250 to get in the profit on the challenge with one spin to go. Come on. Come on. We got to jam the 7-5 suited. Hit it. 40%. That's a good start. That's a fine turn. Come on, let's go. 250 bucks. Book it, chat. Two, 60, three, 89 and buy -ins. Come on, man. Profit guaranteed. Yes. Let's go. Okay. Uh, yeah, so that was 250. There we go. Nice, but we got one more. $100 spin ultra. Can we cap it with something nice here? Hello everyone, I think I have the coolest piece of poker software you've ever seen today. It is called Hybrid Poker. Brand new piece of poker learning software where you test your score against myself, against Daniel Negreanu, against Bill Perkins, and see how you score against the three of us, as well as other poker players as well. But Hybrid Poker learns about you, the player, which is, this is really cool. As Hybrid Poker gets to know you, it's going to tell you what to work on. There's a link to the IQ test down below. Try it for free. I think you'll like it. So try it out. $100 spin ultra. Taking this up to 189 in buy-ins. Oh, for 500. We're playing for 500. This is big. This would be such a nice cap on this spin challenge. And King Queen suited is an all-in moment. I don't know what to tell you. We're gonna make a flush. All right. 500 bucks, man. I mean, it's nice. That'll buy some nice art, honestly. Buy you a nice piece of something. Call the min raise with 9 6. Check, check. Total swing and a miss here with 9 6. I don't think it's the right hand to bluff. We turn a pair of nines, which is cool. We have a bit of a bluff catcher, but it becomes a tough spot on the river, and they bet 50 here out of position. I think we need to call, um, but we're not happy. Oof. Oof. It's a bad river for them to bluff. It's a good river for us to bluff catch. All the straight draws miss, like the gutters, the clubs miss. We do have the six of clubs, but like, it's pretty much a perfect run out. I think we should call. Yeah, I don't know. Like, the human being just wants to fold because, you know, it's like kind of hard to bluff, but then the math is just so good. Jack three suited four blinds. Yep. We're in there. Good luck, us. Against king three. Oh, to stay alive. Keep it clean. No king. Let's go. We're back to 280, chat. We're back to 280. Let's go. It was looking on the ropes there, but we hit it. No good. Here we go. Rejam against the min raise for sure. Same hand. Okay. Club? Okay. 2040, queen five suited. I think we're in there. This is six and a half blinds. The suited queen. Here we go. If they call, we fold, I think. Against two opponents. I think we fold here. If they fold, obviously we call. Right. Okay, nines take it down. A slight lead. Fives is going to be a rejam 
or an open gem. Five, six, ten. I think that's the end of the spin. Oh, 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 just kidding. Just kidding, dude. Just kidding. We're in it to win it, baby. Come on, chat. We're in it to win it, chat. Wow, what a five on the river. Okay. Two to one chip lead ish here. King three for six blinds. Come on, hold. Hold it. Hold it for 500 bucks, baby. Let's go. Come on, chat. $500, baby. Oh, you'll love to see it. Buy ins. 189. Cash is 763. Are you not entertained? Let's go. YouTube, Facebook, Instagram. You liking the spins? Let me know. Comments, thumbs up, whatever you got to do. That's it for this episode. Till next time. Goodbye.